Hi, welcome to Brain Master's videos. Today we will be doing on partial fraction type 3. So, this is the question. Okay, 1 over 4x multiplied to x squared plus 4. So, what we need to do is we need to separate them into two different fractions. So, first over here we will have a over 4x plus bx plus c over x squared plus 4. If you refer to our identifying type, you will be able to know how to separate them into two. So next, we just need to some sort of take out the numerator because when the denominator, they are the same, we are able to uh, cancel them off. So for the numerator line, we will have 1 equals to a multiplied to x squared plus 4. Okay, plus 4x bx plus c. So we have this line now, so we need to substitute a number in okay over here we will substitute x equals to 0 by doing so I will eliminate off this line and I'll be able to find my a okay so 1 equals to a multiplied to 4 divide by 4 on both sides I'll have a equals to 1 over 4 okay achieve so next what I'll have is I will substitute x equals to 1 and a equals to 1 over 4 since I found my A. Okay, so 1 equals to 1 over 4. 2 square will be 1 plus 4. Okay, multiply to 4 and B plus C. So what I'll do is I'll simplify everything and then make this into my equation 1. So by doing so, what I'll have is 16C equals to negative 1 minus 16b. This will be my equation 1. Okay, next, what I'll do is I'll let, I need to find for my equation 2 now, which is x equals to 2. And same thing, I'll substitute a equals to 1 over 4. Okay, so 1 equals to 1 over 4. 4 plus 4, okay, plus a 2b plus c so by simplifying this again what I'll achieve is I'll have negative 2 equals to 32b plus 16c as my equation 2 so I'll substitute equation 1 into equation 2 from here I'll be able to solve my b equals to negative 1 over 16 and I will also be able to find my c is actually equal to 0. Okay, so with this, I need to rewrite my partial fraction. So by substituting the numbers in, I will be able to find my answer for my partial fraction. Okay, so here's my answer. So you'll be able to achieve that 1 over 4x, x squared plus 4. Okay, can be written into, since your a is 1 over 4, I have 1 over 16 in this case. Okay. And my B is negative 1 over 16 and C is 0. So the 16 can be written at the denominator. So I have the negative in front. So I have X over 16. X squared plus 4 instead. Okay. So this will be my answer for the partial fraction. Okay. If you do like our teaching videos, do subscribe to our YouTube channel. And you may also go on to our blog over here okay, for more related questions to practice on. Okay, thank you.